You wake up one morning and you realize you're facing a similar situation as a lot of other people. Your family has expanded, but your house stayed the same size. But you have a problem. Without a ton of cash in the bank, you won't have the funds to buy a new house until you sell your current one. There has to be a way out, right? Stay tuned as we discuss this topic. Michael Hua with Bay Area Connect. You're not alone when financing a home purchase. 38% of buyers reported using funds for a primary residence to upgrade to their new home. There are a few different solutions, and one of those is a bridge loan. A bridge loan is probably the best known method for getting the rates and terms on the mortgage that you want to have without selling your current house first. Best of all, you found your next dream home. You don't have to convince the seller wait until you sold your home, current home. Bridge loans are short-term loans secured with your existing home equity. You can then use the funds as a down payment for the house you're looking to buy. Short-term is the key here. Bridge loans typically terms between six months and a year, and they are also referred to as interim loans, gap financing, or swing loans. The idea behind bridge loan is that the bridge, the gap between when a home buyer needs money and when they have it in the bank. However, because of their short-term nature and the risk factors, interest rates on a bridge loans tend to be higher than mortgages. You'll also likely have to pay an organization fee. Typically, a bridge loan is paid off in one lump sum of a balloon payment. Either as soon as the funds from the sale of the current house are available or at the end of the loan term. Aside from being able to secure the home you want and when you want it, there are other perks to the bridge loans. Interest rates. If interest rates are low when you get the bridge loan and you're ready to buy your new house right away, then you can lock in the low rates of your new home mortgage without waiting for your existing place to sell. Multiple moves. Moving is one of the most stressful life events. Who wants to go through it twice? Sometimes you will have to do is sell your house, move to an apartment, buy another house, and then move again. Bridge loan helps avoid that. With a bridge loan, you can buy your next home and move immediately. If you have to wait to sell your current home before buying your next home, there's a chance you end up having to move into a temporary spot and put your stuff in storage. That is just an extra headache. Speed. Because bridge loans are secured with real estate, they usually get approved and funded very quickly. Appeal. Having a bridge loan can make your offer much more attractive to a seller. It is one less sale contingency they have to worry about. You can get one of your houses for sale. Unlike a home equity loan or a home equity line of credit, HELOC, you can secure a bridge loan while your house is on the market. Cons of bridge loans. As appealing bridge loans may sound, there are some negative factors to consider. Interest rates. Interest rates on bridge loans are usually high, even higher than home equity loans for HELOCs. Double mortgage. If your old home doesn't sell right away, you're stuck paying two mortgages until it sells. While sometimes this isn't a huge issue, if you run into trouble selling your home, it could be a financial disaster. Credit scores. In order to secure a bridge loan, you may have to get good credit. Fees. Most bridge loans come with origination fees, such as administration fees, escrow fees, wiring fees, notary fees, and title policy fees. Those fees can be high and are usually percentage of the loan. Appraisal. In order to determine the value of your current home, a lender will require an appraisal. Appraisal typically runs between 300 and 400, and you have to foot the bill. Lenders usually require that a homeowner has at least 20% equity built up in their home before they would consider extending a bridge loan. That means you're on the hook for three payments, your current home, your new home, and your bridge loan. Default. If your current house doesn't sell, you still have time to pay the bridge loan. That means you're on the hook for the three payments, your current home, your new home, and the bridge loan. Having these three huge financial obligations increases your likelihood of defaulting on one of these loans. Make sure to watch our next video as we discuss how to increase your credit score to get ready to buy your home. Please reach out anytime as my team and I are here to help. If any questions, please give me a call at 650-897-1513. I'm Michael Hill with Bayer Connect. I'm here to provide you a smarter approach to real estate. If you feel we missed something, please leave a comment below. We can discuss in a future video. And if you found this video to be beneficial, please like, comment, and share. Thank you so much. We'll see you in the next video.